Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I will show you guys how to get an Atari 2600 or 2600. I'm not really sure how you say it, but I will show you how to get that emulator running on your PSP or PSP Go. So the first thing you want to do is just make sure your PSP has custom firmware installed and then go over to USB connection, press X and connect your PSP to your PC. Right guys, so over on your computer, I will leave a link in the description if you want to download the emulator. So it's actually hosted on MU Paradise, um, which is kind of cool, but all you want to do is scroll down and just click download on PSP 2600. And this is version 1.1.2. I'm pretty sure this is the latest version um, that you can get right now. Obviously this is a PSP game um, or homebrew game, so it doesn't really get updated. Once it has finished downloading, you can head over to your PC's downloads folder. Now I've already got two games games in here. Uh, these are games I literally just got off the internet, so you guys can find them very easily. You literally just type in Atari uh, 2600 ROMs and there's just so many of them. So I got 2005 mini game. I'm not too sure. I guess this is kind of like a homebrew game. And then I got Demon Attack as well. So again, not too sure what that is, but we're going to find out. So get the emulator, right click the zip file and then select extract here. Now what you need to do is just go inside the emulator folder, go inside of the FW3X folder, take this emulator and drop that in your downloads folder. You then just want to delete this folder right here. Now get your two ROMs and drop them inside of the PSP2600 folder. And now you simply select them again and you need to put them inside of the ROMs folder. So it's fine, they can stay in zip files exactly like this. You don't need to extract them or anything like that. So now we can go back to the downloads folder, copy our whole emulator, go onto your PSP. So let's go inside PSP, game, and right click and paste the entire emulator in here. Um, it should copy across very fast. It's a very small emulator. So once it has copied across, I'll now go onto my PSP, show you guys how to play it, um, a few settings, and yeah, I'll show you what to do next. Right, so once you're back off your PC, you can close out this message and you just want to go over to your memory stick um, so you can find the emulator. So here is mine, Atari 2600. Simply just press X to start it up. So the emulator will look exactly like this and it's actually very simple. Um, you simply just press X on load ROM and now you can choose your games. So they should be in the zip file format. Let's just choose Demon Attack, for example. So just press X to load it. And then the game will just start up like this. So they're very simple um, games. Obviously, they're for the Atari. Um, they don't really interest me. But obviously, some of you guys will like them. They're ma mainly just these like really old-fashioned um, like arcade games, I guess. Well, they're obviously Atari games. But once you're done and playing your game, or you want to edit some settings, you just press Select and it will bring you back to the main menu. Now you can actually scroll down and just press X on settings. And there's one setting that I would probably recommend changing and that is just the render mode. So if you set that to max and then go back to main menu or actually do save settings and then back to main menu and then load the ROM again, um, it will actually be in like full screen mode instead of that like really um, small screen. So yeah, you can play these in full screen. They have working sound as well. So as you can see, the sound is now working for this. Oh, and also the um, like joystick here works as well, which is pretty cool. So yeah, the sounds in these games are actually very annoying. You just press select and you're back on the main menu. And there's also keyboard settings, normal settings, and you can press X if you want to like reset the whole thing. So yeah, pretty cool, simple emulator. Not really the games I'm interested in, but obviously some of you guys will probably like it. And um, we've also got this other game here. 2000, apparently this was made in 2005 or something, so that's kind of interesting. But the sound on this one is very, very annoying, so I'm just going to mute that. But yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. That is how you get an Atari um, 2600 emulator on your PSP. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.